Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at the Performing Arts Lodge in downtown Toronto. I'm here with Louise Petra. What has been the best part about donating your beautiful piano to the residents of PAL here this evening? Oh God, I don't know what the best part is. Just the notion that this could happen at all is still amazing to me. The best part was Rob Lowry just coming up with this, what do you think? I just happen to know that they're looking for a piano at PAL Lodge and me literally screaming out loud when I read that email thinking, I can't even think of a better place for my piano to end up. Oh my God. I said to my husband, we might end up living there someday and I'll be playing my own piano. I mean, how amazing is that? Just to think they're all people from my line of work, my business, you know, who are going to be playing this piano now for years to come. Oh my God. And I someone who's been a performer in the business for so many years, you've been nominated for a Tony, you've won countless awards. Can you tell me a little bit about the importance of this piano and how it sort of fell when you got it and how it fell into your career in terms of the timeline of when you purchased it? Um, I bought it in 1990. Um, I was doing Les Miserables in Toronto and it was the first big show, you know, the first long-running big show that everybody knew about, and I felt that it was such an important show, almost like it was the, the stamp on, yes, I'm going to be okay in this business, you know, I can be a performer now, we can say, mom and dad, I'm going to be okay in this business. And it was my gift to myself, like, sort of uh, making it official that I was going to make my living in this business, you know, it was like my... I'm buying myself something grand and big and important because I'd been playing piano all these years and it was like my stamp of approval for myself and it's always been that to me and it's been a real refuge. I don't make my living playing piano because I have better piano players play for me but I am a piano player and I've worked out a lot of stuff at that piano. I learn all my scores at that piano and I've written all my songs at that piano so it's a huge part of my life my private musical life. And how does it feel for you to have the piano named in your honor here this evening? I know, my God, I couldn't believe Oh, thank you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> this went with the piano. It covered the plaque. Yeah. Um, I, yeah, I thought that was great. That was a surprise to me that they're naming it the Louise Piano. Oh, my God. Although, as I said to them, I think it should be called Louis because it's got the biggest, beefiest bass and strong, mellow, mid-range. It's a male piano to me. <laughs> and what advice would you give to an aspiring actress, someone who's getting into the theater world and into the performing arts? Oh, God. <laughs> Do you know what? I get asked that so often, and there are no rules. There is no right way or wrong way. I did not study acting or dance or anything to do with what I do for a living. I mean, it's amazing. I studied music. I was going to teach music in high school, okay? That's what I wanted to do. If you're smart and you go see a lot of stuff and you say, that's good, that's awful, why? What's he doing that's so good? And learn from it. And do, do, do. And you're continue continuing to do work. Where's the best place to find out more information on your upcoming shows, Annie, um, and your one-woman show, which was just at Theatre Pass Mariah? Where can we find out all that information online? On my website, okay. louisepitre.com, P-I-T-R-E. Um, uh, yeah, we're in rehearsal for Annie right now at YPT, and then I go to Chicago and do Gypsy, which is amazing. So, yeah, it's a, it's a loaded time right now. It's so great. Well, thank you so much. Congratulations on this amazing donation and break a leg. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at PAL in downtown Toronto.
Ready, everybody ready? Yeah. and the libation and just keep this evening going. Thank you so much for coming.